Hi, who? How's it going? Good. How are you? Good. All right. So here to ask you 68 questions. Okay. First one. I guess we already did that. Uh, second one. On a scale of one to ten, how excited are you about life right now? Uh, eight. Coffee or tea? Tea. Favorite part about this community center? That we welcome everyone. What's your favorite movie? Black Panther. Favorite movie in the past five years? Black Panther. Okay. Uh, a book you plan on reading? Michelle Alexander's The New Jim Crow. Okay. Hey, Nisa. Good evening, Curry. So, what book have you read that shaped you like it's all positively? Ronald Takaki's The Stranger from a Different Shore. Bye, Nisa. Bye. Have fun in the library. Thanks. All right. Want to go upstairs? Yeah, that sounds good. Uh, favorite TV show that's currently on? Game of Thrones. What's the last thing you watched? A YouTube video about how to make kimchi. <laughs> Any current issue in the news right now that you particularly care about? Uh, gentrification and displacement. What's your Vietnamese name? Uh, Le Ho Hong Thu. Do you know what it means? Hong Thu is a red finch. Mm -hmm. and, um, but Thu is a mythical bird. Cool. Um, what's your favorite food? Bun sale. Ooh. Least favorite food? Plain tofu. Okay. Favorite drink? Um, ice cream tea. Uh, favorite dessert? Uh, apple pie. Favorite local restaurant? In Boston, overall, Eastern Standard. In Dorchester, Coco Leaf. What's your favorite menu items from those places? At Eastern Standard Oysters, mm -hmm. at Coco Leaf, their flan. What's the hardest thing about being a mom? 5 a.m. wake up calls. Ooh. What's your favorite band or solo musical artist? I was obsessed with No Doubt when I was a teenager. Solid choice. Yeah. How long have you been working with Via Dade? So I've been in ED since January 2018, but I interned in 2003 when I was in college, and then I was on the board from 2013 to 2014. If you could sing a duet with anyone, who would it be? Luciano Cavati, um, so his voice would be drawn out mine. <laughs> a skill you're working on mastering? Knitting. Best gift you've ever received? A gold necklace from my mom for my wedding. Best gift you've ever given? A grandchild. Fair. Okay. How would you define yourself in three words? Loyal, fair, and committed. What's your favorite board game? Ticket to Ride. Favorite country to visit? I haven't been to enough places, um, but I love Montreal. What's the last country you visited? Canada. Okay. What country do you wish to visit? Japan. Favorite color? Uh, cranberry. Least favorite color? Magenta. Where did you go to college? Uh, Tufts University. And what did you study there? Uh, American Studies and Biopsychology. Best way to de-stress? Taking long walks. Uh, if you had one superpower, what would it be? Whatever power Jean Grey has. <laughs> What's the weirdest word in the English language? Xylophone. If you were a kitchen utensil, what would you be? Can opener. What's your favorite flower? Uh, white peonies. When was the last time you cried? A couple months ago. Do you like your handwriting? Yes, because I've practiced it a lot. Do you bake? I love baking. I just don't have enough time. Best thing you've ever baked? Croissants. What's your least favorite thing about yourself? I'm too hard on myself. What is your most favorite thing about yourself? I don't give up. Who do you miss the most? My dad. Mm -hmm. What are you listening to right now? Um, a Hidden Brain podcast. Best piece of advice you've received? To trust my instincts. Best advice you'd give your teenage self? Don't be in so hard on yourself. And it's not that big of a deal, whatever it is. Favorite smell? 
Jasmine Blossoms. Hmm. Who was the last person you talked to on the phone? I called on home to do uh, to put in a takeout order. Uh, who was the last person you sent a text to? Uh, my husband, Alex. Your go-to for having a good laugh? A tickle fest with my toddler. Favorite season? Spring. Okay. Three people alive or dead that you would like to have dinner with? Um, my paternal grandmother, um, mm-hmm. Yuri Kochiyama, mm-hmm. and Grace Lee Box. Uh, where were you born? Uh, Fangrang, Vietnam. Uh, is that a, is that a photo of it? Yeah. Yeah, the, um, it's where I was born, and my uh, mom's family is from Dala. Very cool. Okay, when did you emigrate here? Uh, August 1990. What is the farthest you've been from home? Boston. (laughs) A local community member you admire? Uh, Suzanne Lee. Um, She's a Chinatown and education activist that's um, that's really shaped my life. What book have you read again and again? Do bedtime stories count? Sure. Um, Harry Potter. Okay. And does that count as your favorite bedtime story? No. Good night, Lunas. Favorite memory in this community center? Uh, Bet this year. What would be the title of your autobiography? A Life Well Fed. <laughs> Favorite sound? Um, giggles. Favorite animal? A tie between my two very silly cats, Musubi and Fukatsu. If you made a documentary, what would it be about? Gentrification through the lens of toddlers. And last photo that you took. A plate of food. A plate of food. (laughs) (laughs) Well, that's all the questions we have. Uh, Thank you so much for doing this. Thank you.